Okay, guys. So look what we have here. Um, I got this for uh, for my birthday. It is a uh, Char Griddler Acorn Junior Kamado Pit. Um, I've been wanting something like this. Now I do want a bigger one, but of course they're a lot more money. Um, but I was able to get this on sale. And so I, we were able to order it. I got it through Amazon, and uh, I've had I've had it, uh, you know, about two weeks already, and I haven't burned it in. I haven't used it, but I wanted to just do a quick little video of you guys being able to see that we're going to be cooking on something new, guys. This is going to be awesome. But I but I want to show it to you guys. So let's uh let's open it up and. Uh, of course, it's got the the instruction manuals right here. So I'm going to set this to the side. And this right here, I'm going to show you what this does. This right here is for the for the grill. So what you do is you you pick up your grill with this so you can take it out. And I'm going to set it down right here. And um, um, I did buy this. I did buy this pan right here. Um, it's a pizza pan and um, it's to do uh, in indirect cooking so but I also did order on this these come with a uh, they come with a smoking stone which which sits inside the pit and that allows for indirect cooking so the, the charcoal sits underneath and then you put this on top to smoke uh, you can also grill you can take this out grill steaks or whatever if you need it on high heat whatever, whatever you want to do guys um, and it has, let me show you, it has this right here, which this is where the smoking stone sits at. It sits right in there. And then, uh, then you have, you know, then you have the pit itself right here. So, but this sits in here like this. And um, it does have, you know, a little grill. That's where your, your charcoal sits you know inside and it sits on top and then of course you know you have the smoking stone and then I did buy the pizza pan to sit it on top to give me more of an expansion and then of course you got the grill but let me let me show you guys how this grill looks um, this is how it looks inside guys uh, it's got it's got a, a good seal around here um, it's about I would say almost about an inch thick guys. It's pretty thick. Uh, they're very very well insulated I can tell you that like I said uh, It has the bowl here and then you have the grill itself. So it adds more protection to the grill um, as you can see uh, The smoking stone Sits on top like this, but I kind of wanted you know, I wanted more of an area to try to avoid so much grease like dripping around the smoking stone and, st and stuff like that so that's why guys i bought this pizza pan and it sits right on top like that and as you can see on the perimeter it still it still gives me room for he uh indirect heat to come out and do the cooking itself and then of course um you know you got the grill And the grill sits right on top like that and so yeah then you know i just got that those are just the directions and and then of course this is how you pick up your grill to take it out whenever you know you're done you want to take it out put more charcoal refill it whatever but but yeah and uh it it folds down and then you got it right here to where you lock it in place and it locks and and here's this right here here's the here's the settings um it does have numbers i know it's hard to see because it's it's dark uh let me see if i can maybe yeah you can see them right there guys see zero one two three four five so depending on how how open you want it it's up to you you know so you know that's a five if you want it all the way open right there and then you know you can slowly start close it to a four a three a two a one 
a half and then just shut it down and then down here guys it's kind of the same it's kind of the same concept um, you know whenever you load turn on your charcoal you know you want to open up your vents all the way like that and then once you got your charcoal to where you need it you know you just kind of you know once you're done grilling you just completely shut it down but yeah you'll you know you'll just make adjustments here as far as how you want your grill how hot you want it and, and at what temp you're gonna smoke at and all that but yeah it's a uh guys it is a nice Kamado grill it, it is awesome and I wanted to do a video on it because I just quickly wanted to show you guys how how awesome this little grill is it's it is orange they had different colors they had red black and I believe uh, a blue color I'm not sure but this is what I wanted and this is what I got but yeah guys um, I'm gonna do a burn in on it because you know I need to get it all cleaned up and everything but I'm gonna do a burn in it and, and get it going and guys this is gonna be in our future videos and believe it or not I plan on doing pork butts and briskets and ribs in here so we're gonna see those guys we are so um, well guys I hope you enjoy this little video um, I wanted to show it to you on a nice sunny day out here and it is sunny here and good temperature and I wanted to I wanted you to see it because it's an awesome awesome grill guys but yeah that we're gonna do some upcoming video guys we're gonna do some upcoming videos and man we're gonna enjoy them and we're gonna use this pit for a long long time and we're still gonna use those webers so um yeah guys all right guys well i'm gonna let you guys go and um i'm, I'm probably gonna make a video tonight so just uh we'll see all right guys y'all have a good day